Rick joined by a couple stars of the Spartan defense, linebacker Joe Bocci, defensive end Kenny Willekes. Guys, this was an elite defense a year ago, but I know you both think that it can be even better. Tell me where you guys can improve. I'm interested from both of you, and Joe, you can start. Uh, I'll let Kenny hit his part, but you know, as a whole defensively, we got to create more turnovers. Uh, you look at our team the past two seasons, we've been good against the run, obviously, but we are not very good at getting turnovers. We got to get the ball off. Uh, Coach D's time here, you know, the Big Ten championship years, the turnover margin was big time, and that's what we got to get back to. Kenny? Yeah, Joe talked about the turnovers, but up front, our biggest focus has been sacks. Obviously, like you said, we're, we're the number one run defense in the country last year, but I think 56 in sacks, and that's a number that we want to increase. We've been working to increase every day. You know, one, one of the good things when you talk about playing in this linebacker group is the guys up front. Describe how they make your jobs at the linebacker position a lot easier. Yeah, well, they have a lot of experience, I'll tell you that. And uh, Mike Panashuk the other day he came, comes in and, you know, he wakes up in the morning thinking about double teams. That's what he said. And I don't know, I don't know how somebody can think like that, but he does. Um, and it helps me out a great ton. Um, he's able to hold people off, whether it's power, inside zone. You know, it frees me up and the other linebackers a lot. Yeah. Kenny, you guys get up the field. That first step that you have and defensive tackles that you have really create havoc up there. Do you get upset when those guys are able to make all the tackles? Uh, the inside guys, they tell, they joke about it sometimes, how they have to hold up blocks for uh, Joe and the other linebackers. But, you know, when you got great players inside like Raekwon, Mike, and uh, Naquan Jones, you know, it makes my job and this other defensive end jobs, linebackers' job, makes it so much easier for us. When they got to worry about and double-team those guys in the middle, you know, it makes our job on the edge a lot easier. You had a chance to leave if you wanted to. What made you come back? Uh, you know, I discussed it a lot with my family. Uh, Joe is someone I obviously talked about with it a lot. But, uh, you know, we were 7-6 last year, and that's not good enough for us. We came here to chase championships, and uh, we want to be better than that. So we're trying to leave a legacy, leave a different mark on this program when we leave. Joe, any individual goals or group goals for that linebacking core? We want to be the best in the Big Ten. Uh, that's number one. And then if we can take it from there, and hopefully then we'll be a top, you know, group in the country, top unit in the country. But, you know, personally, I don't have any personal goals right now other than winning a Big Ten championship. You know, that's our goal. Start with winning the East and uh, take it from there. Kenny, yours is a great story from walk-on to All-American. I'm sitting next to a guy here who's a former walk-on walk and played more than a decade <laughs> in the NFL, scored a couple touchdowns in the Super Bowl. What's the lesson in your story and in the story of successful walk-ons in general? You know, the biggest thing I think is just relentlessness. You know, no matter what happens, you know, no matter how the day's going, how the year's going, if you're on a scout team, you know, no matter what you're doing, you just got to bring it each and every day. Try to learn something new, you know, try to pick up on something each and every day. I say, you know, try to be the dumbest guy in the room. Try to learn something new every day and, you know, just give it your all and uh, eventually it'll work out. And Joe, finally from you, we heard about Kenny and his decision to come back. How about you? What was the process of, of your thoughts in terms of whether or not you'd return? Yeah, um, you know, I'm taking pride on, you know, getting that degree. That was really my main thing. Um, me and my parents talked about it. No one in my family's done it before. So, you know, that means a lot to me. Um, then obviously on the football field, you know, Big Ten Championship, chase that. Uh, since I came here, you know, we haven't been there yet. The previous three years before I got here, we were the Rose Bowl, Cotton Bowl playoffs. And, you know, I want to get there. I want to get to the standard that's been set. And hopefully we can do that this year because that's our goal. Joe Bocci, Kenny Willekes, thanks for your time, guys. Have a great year. Yep, thank you. Thank you for having us.